It appears that the United States of America is once again turning its attention towards Huawei and this could potentially pose an alarming situation for the Chinese tech giant. As many of us know, the U.S. blocked Huawei from producing new chipsets in 2020, which led to chip producers including Taiwan's TSMC ceasing business with the Chinese company. However, in August, Huawei released the Huawei Mate 60 Pro smartphone equipped with the Kirin 9000's chipset, which came as quite a surprise to the entire smartphone industry. The United States began questioning how Huawei managed to develop a flagship chipset despite the existing ban raising concerns. Recently, the U.S. Commerce Secretary announced that the United States would take strong action against companies involved in a recent chip breakthrough in China. The situation is escalating, and this statement from the U.S. Commerce Secretary is partly a response to growing pressure from opposition groups, particularly Republicans, who want the Biden administration to take action against China's SMIC and Huawei and completely cut them off from the supply chain. As of now, the U.S. Commerce Secretary has not confirmed any formal action against Huawei or SMIC, but the U.S. Commerce Department's Bureau of Industry and Security is actively investigating the 7 nm chipset process used by Huawei. The secretary emphasized that investigations take time to gather information, and their intention is to take the strongest possible action to protect America. Despite the mounting pressure, Huawei appears to be calm and confident about their work. According to Huawei, they haven't done anything wrong and they are already operating under a ban. As a result, it seems that Huawei might not be greatly concerned about this statement. I'm preparing a dedicated video to explain the main reasons why the USA is focusing on Huawei, so make sure to hit the subscribe button to get notified when it's released. What do you think? Should Huawei be worried about this statement? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. As always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.